welcome students let's learn about our need for air but before that let's solve a riddle there's something there it is to be found up and down and all around you can't touch it you can't see it but sure as sure you can name it it's air let's try this blow a balloon what did you fill into it of course air there is air all around us though we can feel it we cannot see it air does not have color smell or taste let's learn some new terms inhalation we breathe in air to our nose that is inhalation exhalation we breathe out air through the nose that is exhalation respiration inhalation and exhalation are together called breathing we breathe continuously that is called respiration can you tell when a man is sleeping quietly why do we see his chest going up and down when we perform respiration our chest expands and relaxes every time to let air in and out due to this inhalation and exhalation the chest of a man is seen going up and down why do we breathe we need our body to function properly we need air for that purpose when we breathe in we take air into our body air makes us feel fresh and lively air is necessary for our body to get the vigor we need to work properly like us all other living things also need air if we look carefully we can see a dog and a cat's chest also going up and down it tells us that animals also breathe do you know fish live in water it makes one wonder how they get the air to breathe but fish are able to use the air that is dissolved in water some people keep fish in a glass fish tank it is called an aquarium it is always full of water the fish in the aquarium use the air dissolved in the water for breathing as a result the amount of air dissolved in the water can get reduced if all the air was used up the fish would die therefore more air is continuously added to the water in the aquarium that is why we see air bubbles rising up through the water in such fish tanks let's try this take a glass more than half full of clean water take a small piece of a newspaper sheet roll it to make a straw about 10 cm long dip one end of the straw into the water to the other end blow into it with your mouth what do you see bubbles rise up in the water what does this tell us you blew air into the water this air rose up and escaped in the form of bubbles always remember every day one must spend some time playing in an open playground to get fresh air thank you and please like share and subscribe